noted author with us. You can wave hands, clap to welcome him. We have an eminent personality, Sri Deva Prasad Das, with us today. So we welcome you. Kindly be seated. Good afternoon and namaskar to all. To formally begin, said a good book, I'm a book on your mantel shelf, but I can be a part of your living self. I will make you fitter to talk with men. I will touch with silver the lines you pen. If only you travel my pages through, then I will travel the world with you. It's true. The bliss, the joy of reading books can't be expressed. It only can be experienced. So it is rightly said that today a reader, tomorrow a leader. But before we begin the proceedings of the day, honoring the rich heritage and mission of DAV, I request all the day's dignitaries and all the students to kindly rise up for the soulful DAV dance. Children, we expect, <laughs> yes. Aviral nirmal salil sadai, gyan pradai ni jyot mai, ho chahun dishi udkhosh abhai, Diye vi jai jai, diye vi jai jai. Prabal pravah mai nit nootan, jeevan daai ni sada sanatan, ved pranita param punita, ye dhara akshay. Diye vi jai jai, से प्रेम भक्ति ले हंस राज से त्याग शक्ति ले धर्म भक्ति का राष्ट्र शक्ति का हो दिन मान उदय दिए वी जय जय दिए वी जय जय सुख समृद्धि इसकी लहरे प्रेम शांति इसके तट ठहरे सघन शांति में प्रबल क्रांति में लिए अटल निश्चय दिए वी जय जय दिए वी जय जय May I request our principal ma'am to formally welcome our guest speaker. Ma'am, please. Children, we are welcoming the speaker who is amongst us. Sir, I kindly request you. To welcome with our flower. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, sir. Esteemed invitee of the day, Sri Deva Prasad Das, Revered Regional Director, Odisha Zone, Dr. K.C. Satpati, with his good wishes and blessings. Respected Principal, Madam Indira Bhattacharya, Respected Academic Supervisors, Dear Teachers, and all my loving students. On, beha on behalf of DAV Public School, Chandrasekharpur, and 
Dr. Raja Ramana Central Library, I take the privilege to welcome you all to the celebration of National Book Week, particularly to today's event, Meet the Author 2022. To promote the culture of reading and to contribute our bit to this noble movement, over the years, DAV Chandrasekharpur has stepped up its activities to make National Book Week more eventful and popular among the students. It has become a fixed event, like an annual celebration in DAV's calendar. Dear students, to elaborate and enlighten about the world of books, we have an eminent personality amongst us. I'm extremely honored and elated to welcome the illustrious author, Sri Deva Prasad Das. Sir, is a multi-talented person. He's the face of the news hour since 1989 and for many subsequent years in Doordarshan. He's a senior OS officer of 1990 batch. Sri Deva Prasad Das is a popular news anchor, dedicated academician, an influential orator, actor, and most importantly, he is a prolific writer. Sri Deva Prasad Das, he compares in state level programs. He is a versatile genius. His talk always exhibits Indian ethos, our culture, and values. His programs are as adorable and appreciated as Siddharth Kak's program. He anchored a show which was attended by President of India and many union ministers. He acts as a resource person in different orientations and refreshes programs in administrative and management domain. He is well known for his administrative acumen and straightforwardness. Born in Das Vidya Dharpur, Satyabadi in holy land of Puri, Sri Deva Prasad Das showed endless possibilities of his creativity. He's a bachelor in law and did MA and MPhil in political science. Connecting with the readers, Sri Deva Prasad sir owns a collection of creative writing to his name, which includes Indra Dhanura Ranga, Gajapati, Donga, Moha, Bhor, and many more. The list is endless. Some of his essays include Ama Samayo, Dukhara Ilaka, Ananya Prabandha, Atankabad, and the list goes on. He edited collective stories named Jiyo. Deva Prasad sir translated Desa Paradesa, which is story of Kamleshwar in Hindi. His words gave spark to his imagination and during this journey, he has been conferred upon several awards and accolades, such as Odisha Sahitya Academy Award, Bhuvaneshwar Book Fair Award, Katha Nava Pratibha Award, Kishori Charan Das Story Award, Katha Samman, Amritayan, and Sudhanya Award for Story, just to name a few. We are extremely delighted to have such a super talented person with us, an eloquent speaker, news reader, actor, stage coordinator, productive writer, and so on. So we are fortunate to have you with us, sir. Before we call the noted author to address us, I request our principal ma'am to address the gathering. Ma'am, please. Very good afternoon. One and all present over here in this campus now under the canopy and on the stage. Esteemed dignitaries of, of the function today, Deva Brata Das, Sri Dukta Deva Brata Das, Deva Prashad Das, sir, Pradeep Panda, sir, our senior librarian, all the teachers present over here, supervisors, and my dear students. Before the author speaks he over here, I'll not dare to address you. It is not the address, it is the welcome on behalf of all of you. It is the privilege and honor for me that I, for my position, it is, I got it to welcome on behalf of you all, sir, to our campus. Again, sir, from all of us, a hearty welcome to our campus.
Students, just now you heard about his biodata. You have listened, I hope. If you have minutely listened, only one thing I want to tell you, that you all aspire to be something in your future. But those who are very small children sitting in front of me, six, seven, eight, probably you have not decided. Or probably you are thinking, seeing your uh, elder brother, sister, that I will also be like this. And my 9, 10, 11, 12 students, if you are here, you might have thought of that, what you want to be in your future. But students, keep it in mind that beside being doctor and engineer, many more opportunities are there in front of you. And one example is sir. So you have listened, Sahit Academic Award, and so many awards he got, and he is very successful and well-established person here in front of you. So if you choose literature as your career, it is good. Do you think it is good, good enough to get name and fame in the society? What else we want? So it is the opportunity for all of you to meet such a person and listen from him. And you are free to ask your queries, your doubts. Keep it ready so that we will give some of the children the opportunities. You will come here and directly interact. Okay, sir, I will not take much of the time. It is stage is yours and you will be directing directly talking to our students. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Now I would like to invite, let's hear from the expert himself. So we all are eagerly waiting for your illuminating words. So I welcome you, sir. Thank you, ma'am Jyoti. My best wishes to all of you and Namaskar and a very good afternoon. Honorable Principal, Srimati Bhattacharya, Honorable Librarian, Sushil Banda, and the person who has been instrumental in inviting me here, Mr. Pati, fellow faculty members and teachers, all the staff of the school, and my dear students, while traveling in Bhuvaneshwar, many times I have come across your school while going through that road. Always I thought that I never read in DAV school, Chandrasekhar Puth. At least once I should get inside. And today is the opportunity to interact with you and to come and meet you. This is my privilege. I'm very happy and I'm honored to be here. You know, before starting about the books and uh, what do I write, I want to narrate a very funny incident of my life. You must have been, most of you, must have been reading here from lower KG or from standard one and will be completing standard 12 in future from this place. I read in many schools and colleges because my father was in a transferable job. So when I started, I started from Cambridge School, Katak. Then I came here. There was a Odia school near Governor House. I read there. Am I clear? Eko, eko hunita. Then, I read at Jagatpur near Katak. My fifth class I read at Katak, that is Jobra. I read in Brajanath Barjana High School for my sixth class in Dhankanath. My seventh class I read in Ramakrishna Paramahansa School here in Bhuvaneshwar. My eighth and ninth class. I studied at Unit 1 High School, Bhuvaneshwar. At that time, there used to be 11th class. So my 10th and 11th, I read at DN High School, Keonjar. So how many schools I have gone through? Then, 
I came to study in BJB College, Bhubaneswar. I again went back to Keunjar for my second year. My graduation was from Ravensa College, Kotak. And my post-graduation was from Utkal University, Bani Bihar, where from I also completed my MPhil. Then I completed my law from University Law College. So I had gone through many schools, many colleges, and really I did not have many childhood friends, two or three maximum. But you are privileged that so many friends you have. And when we talk about friends, we take about two years senior to us and even two years below to us. So they are all friends. In your long life, you will come across these friends, you will meet them, and you will have a lot of interaction. And all of you will be achieving higher positions in life. And those days you will be remembering this school which taught you everything and which shaped your character, your personality, and the way you have come across in your life. So a big cheer for your school, which has made you. Thank you. Usually, I write short stories. Short stories, you know, many of you must have been reading. This should be interactive. Raise your hands. How many of you read other books than the textbooks? So many of you. I am very happy, extremely happy. Hands down. We have so many entertainments these days. Television is there, internet is there. Those schools must not be allowing mobile phones inside. But once you go back to home, you must be using mobile phones. So there are a lot of information available before you. Why should one read book? As you are celebrating National Book Week, Jatiya Pustaka Saptaha, why should one read books? Bohi padile konava. We have so many things, we are getting information from every source. And why should we read books? Because book is the most valuable friend in your life. Even Mahatma Gandhi was influenced by two books, one of John Ruskin and the second one by Leo Tolstoy. Many of the famous personalities, books have influenced their personalities. Because when you are alone, you are lonely, no one is with you. It is the book that remains with you. We see adversities in life. Many times we cry. Many times we feel sorrow, many times we get sad. And many of us don't interact with others because of ego, because of obvious other reasons. But we don't interact. We are not able to interact, in fact. So I should not tell anyone, not to even my friends, not to even parents. So, so many things reside inside us and we don't interact with others. Do you know the most alarming situation? What we are facing today? The children are committing suicide. Why? Because they feel so lonely. They feel so isolated. That's why it is happening. You don't need anyone if you have a friend called book with you. Whenever you are sad, whenever you are happy, Whenever you feel rejected, whenever you feel dejected, whenever you feel down and out, you just get a book and you will get the inspiration. That is why book is called the most valuable friend we get in life. You must have read about Vishnu Sarma's Panchatantra. When we were children, we were also reading Panchatantra. You must have read, have you thought of, since time immemorial, Panchatantra is getting percolated down to generation after generation after generation. Why? What is the reason of the popularity of Panchatantra? Jetabla ame pade, the wise kuro, 
पानी पीवा को गला गोटा माठिया रो अल्प पानी थिला व्हाट डिड इट डी डू इट ब्रॉट सम स्टोन्स एंड पुट इट इनसाइड द पॉट एंड द वाटर रोज सो बिकॉज़ ऑफ दैट शी शी वुड बी एबल टू ड्रिंक वाटर सो दैट टॉट अस that you don't lose anything in life you don't lose uh, don't lose hope you will be successful if you try similarly there was a story two friends very close friends they went to the woods and a bear came got a bhalu asila got a sanga jani thala gacho pur chadiwa chadi gala the other friend didn't know second kala mala bhaliya padi ki raila bhalu asila it smelled the friend went away jetola aro sanga ta ulai ki asila pachala are bhalu to te kon kohutala what did the bear tell you the friend said a friend in need is a friend indeed tu jodi gacho chodiwa jani chu chali golu mu to jani nathili mote bhalu hoye to kamudi dei thanta but i survived because se mote kahi dei gola so bele sanga mor dorkar nai je aboshyak bele chhadi ki chali jaye so that also teaches us the story teaches us morals of life so that is because we read a book because it inspires and so many things we are taught by the book good bad how do we live our life the book is a stress buster whenever you are strained whenever you are stressed sabu chinta kashta dukha ko bahi durai die amo bhitare jo समस्या अच्छे जोड़ा को हमें फेस करिया पे कोस्टर पाउंड जिम्ती आप लोगों को तो समस्त वर्ड थी बो हाउ टू गेट मोर स्कोर्स मोर मार्क्स हाउ टू बिकम फर्स्ट क्लास फर्स्ट हाउ टू बिकम द टॉपर इन द क्लास बट एवरीवन कैन बी एबल टू डू दैट डोंट लूज दैट महात्मा गांधी वाज नॉट ए ग्रेट स्टूडेंट you have read about albert einstein einstein was not a great student he used to calculate wrongly so many mathematics easy mathematics so these books teach us that we can fight any adversities in life it gives us knowledge amo gyano ko badhai thai the book also tries to exercise our brain when we think of eta hitla seta hitla seto bale amaro mastishka कार्यक्षम रुहे काम करे इट इंप्रूव्स आवर फोकस एकाग्रता बढाए व्हेन यू आर रीडिंग ए बुक यू फील लाइक वाचिंग ए मूवी और वाचिंग ए टीवी सीरियल यू आर कंसंट्रेटिंग ऑन दैट ऑन द बुक द वर्ड्स द राइटिंग स्टाइल व्हाट द राइटर वांट्स टू टीच यू सो इट आल्सो इंक्रीजेस योर फोकस देन इट इंक्रीजेस आवर मेमोरी otherwise if you read textbooks you may not be remembering but you have read a good book you will be remembering jemti ame gote bolo film dekhle asi sango kohilu are setre eya story eitla anek apan man ko bitru gita mone rakhi gai dei paranti similarly ebe apan mane gau thile na dev song you have all remembered it tenu bahi te semti it increases our memory power we remember lot many things it also entertains us a good book always entertains us manoranjan jogai it is also it makes us empathetic ame anuman ko pai kibhali byavahar kariba amo bhitare sympathy and empathy kemti grow karibo how do we feel the sorrows of others how can we assimilate in the society how can i make friends all these things are taught by the book it improves our communication skill if we read something then we learn about many new words you see i have told you i read in many odia medium or vernacular schools during my time there was not much of english medium schools so how do i learn how did i learn english by reading books by reading newspapers so it increased my vocabulary i was well versed with many words now when i am in a job i have to write in english because of that knowledge the book has taught me because of that i am able to write in english 
and explain myself what I want to say. Similarly, it also improves our mental health. It makes us happy from within. It gives us the resilient capacity to fight adversity. And it also increases our life. Do you, have you heard about a disease called Alzheimer's? Have you heard? Have you heard about Parkinson's? These are the diseases the old men suffer from. What happens? Suddenly one day, the man forgets everything. He cannot remember even his children. He cannot remember his uh, deeds. He cannot remember even his address to his home. These diseases happen to those people who are not doing anything. They don't read. They don't write. They don't talk. They don't watch anything. That means those people who are close, they suffer from Parkinson's Alzheimer's. So books also improve your mental power and it also helps you to live longer. So many ways books help us. Those can be divided into two things. One is fiction, one is reality. Some people write about realism, realities, and some people write about the interpreter of maladies. That book was, that book received Booker Prize. That is about a doctor writing about the disease cancer. But this time, the Booker Prize was given to Reth Samadhi, written by Srimati Gitanjali Sri. That book is a, about a story of an old woman who suffered partition of India. So one is fiction, one is realism. Jane Karpunaru bhabiki gote charitra tiyari kare ta upare lekhe. Aau kichhi kotha, aamo bastava jibano ru aase, taku leki madhya ame lekhi paru. Aau gote kotha bohi kare, they gives you emotion. Aamo ko bhava pramana ta diye. Find the key emotion. And you can write also, you can read also. Kudra Galpa Mujo Lekhe Chota Chota Gopo. Se Gopo Bistare Wajaichi. Se sa kahani ku sigra poliki sardeovo. Put a novel pole, it's too long. It takes time. Jodi Amegote essay poliva. It takes time. Maybe it will be complicated. Short stories are written within two, three, four pages. So we can immediately finish it. From start to finish, we can go on and complete it. So that's why short story is the most popular genre among all the literary pursuits. time So ethire onek loko kunte kuda beginning thibo kuda end thibo mane kuda arambha thibo kuda sesha thibo. But check up kunte the short story gives a slice of life to you. Jibonoro kichhi kotha se kahi jao thibo. Purvaru kuda kahani re kuda charitra thibo bada charitra. One protagonist and many other side characters around him or many events. These days, short stories have been modernized. Now it can be about one moment, one incident, one event, one character, some communication. Even move to Sandhya Kujai, Apraman Kaseto, you interact on the la, Tao Puribi, what a Kahani Leki de Paro. So, got a moment of Kothamotio. It may be about village, it may be about city, it may be about a school, it may be about college, it may be about canteen, it may be about uh, a tea shop, it may be about your playground, it may be about uh, something you have heard from someone and it created an emotion inside you and you have started writing. Mudbekutli Bortman Japanagoro, Dayanan Saraswati, Mohodejo Kaichindi. So there are many learned men, but those who, to, those who tell the universal truth, they are the actual learned men. Others who have only been taught, who have only jāku kwaajana rati ki ghosi ki sikitaanti, seman ko tulanare, jomane sarbajani na satya ko kohanti, the universal truth those who tell, they are free from prejudice, ebang seman jaha kohanti, that is applicable to all of us, not only to children, it also applies to adults and it applies to everyone 
in their life if they follow. You may ask me, how did I start writing? When I was reading in post-graduation in Bani Vihar, we had a magazine. It is called Bani Vikas. And there we were contributing. I wrote my first story for that. And funnily, I wrote it for a girl who didn't know Odia. So when it was published, I thought that she will read it and compliment me. But she did, didn't know Odia. So naturally, she didn't read. I didn't receive any compliment. The second story I wrote was for Katha, a magazine published by the Sambad group of newspaper. It was for the competition. They were hunting new talents. And for that, I wrote the second story of my life. And I won also. But I thought, why am I writing? Only to win a prize? Only to get felicitated? Only to be appreciated by someone? The third story, it motivated me. How did I write this third story? At that time, in uh, 95, the Doordarshan Kendra was in Kotak. I was staying in Bhuvaneshwar. When I had my assignments, I was going to Kotak and from my relatives, my grandfather's house, I was taking a rickshaw and going to Doordarshan Kendra. The interaction between the rickshaw puller and myself, that formed the basis of my third story. And I was overwhelmed. I found that life teaches you many incidents. Many of you must be writing for your school magazines. Many of you may not be making characters, may, may not be making careers out of writing. But now, writing is a very promising job. Once you are a writer, you get name and fame, as your principal madam was saying, and you get appreciated by others when your books are read. I think you, any of you can become a Chetan Bhagat. Whatever he is writing, he is writing out of his own emotion, out of his own experiences. In colleges, he wrote, you, have, you must have seen three idiots. Three idiots were written on his experience in IIT. So you can think of writing such novels, such stories, out of your own experiences while you interact with your fellow students, with your teachers, in your school, outside the school, in your family. You can pick up the characters and you can write. And the best stories are, or the best writings are, when you pour your emotions out with a little bit of fictional addition. You are the best storyteller. And I feel everyone can write. If you think seriously, all of you can write. Writers are not born out of something that it's a God's gift, it's a blessing, a ray of hope comes from sun and creates a writer. No, you can, every one of you can be a writer. If you think, if you start writing today, you can write. Any emotion, any moment, any friend, any character, any event you have come across, you start writing and you will become a writer. No one becomes a perfect writer from the beginning. Gradually we become writers. Slowly we become writers. And you get appreciation. It is only your insight to an incident or to a character that makes you a better writer. What I am writing, you may be writing much better than me. What you are writing, your friend may be writing much better than you. So that is the way the writing goes on. If you feel emotionally about an incident or a character, you can become a writer. Every day, every day, we are coming across many characters. You are going there, now after the school is over, you will be going out. When in the traffic square, you see a character. Very interesting, peculiar character. You write about that. You write about him. And that becomes a story. So it is not that we pick up certain things from Nowhere. It is the people, the events you come across that makes you a writer. So you are all writers. You can start writing. And writing has a lot of prospects these days. And you see, everyone will be an engineer, will be a doctor, will be an IAS officer, will be an OS officer. Many of you will happen, uh, become scientists. But a writer adds on to your personality. In spite of all this, you know 
uh, why i am telling about chetan bhagat because he is a popular writer chetan bhagat left his job and became a full time writer in odisha also there is an is officer who left his job and became a full fledged writer why they are doing that it is because the writing gives them extra proficiency and name and fame when you are writing if you write in your mother tongue if you are writing in english and it gets translated into other languages so a writer has no boundary ame pila dino sanskrit re padutulo na vidwan sarvatra pujyate a learned man he worshiped everywhere so when you become a writer and your writings get translated into other languages you will get a name and fame beyond boundaries it is not within the geographical entity of odisha you are popular in kerala you are popular in west bengal you are popular in punjab you are popular in gujarat you are popular in maharashtra even if lord favors you like gitanjali sri you may be popular even outside india so start writing start reading wherever i go i always tell children that read one english newspaper one odia newspaper and any book you like many of you may be cricket buff may be football lover may be tennis player many autobiographies biographies are there you can read about sachin tendulkar you can read about saurabh ganguly you can read about sunil gavaskar you can read about kapil dev you can read about sania mirza you can read about saina nehwal many books are available whatever interests you you just write about you just read about them and that will motivate you to write so i think this national book week will not be confined to this week only this will carry on throughout your life even if you are not a writer you just read go on reading and the value addition to your life do you know about value addition these days we say ame tomato tiyari korchu value addition hoi gale kon hochi se thru sauce hoi padchi ame apple phala ani ki khauchu value addition hoi gale kon hochi ta dhare fruit juice tiyari hoi padchi to value addition ta ei bhali hue even if you are in one profession if you read it expands your vision onno mane jetobale katha kohutbe au apan jetobale kohibe you will be adding more value to your talks and others will listen are this person is so knowledgeable but that knowledge is acquired knowledge it is not achieved knowledge but that acquired knowledge also helps you whenever we go somewhere whenever we we talk people listen to us only because are ye kotha kemte kahuchi mor gyan no mo jo bahi padichi i pick and choose from them and i tell them so they think that i am a very learned man i am actually not that learned but the knowledge comes from the books which i have read great men have seen life in different ways and they narrate life in different ways so when we add on those knowledge to our knowledge it becomes a combo which is appreciated by everyone and you will feel that this man is very knowledgeable when you go to college after that when you go to jobs you see the book knowledge will help you to endure ahead and to take you ahead and be leaving behind others and you will be in the forefront because people will appreciate you acknowledge you for your knowledge and that knowledge is oh, yeah. you read books by purchasing you read it from internet many books are available in internet your library must have many books so don't be confined to your textbooks only you just go on reading that will help you in your life i tell you from my own experience thank you uh, madam principal thank you all others and thank you children and now i will be taking up some questions if you have thank you so much sir after your address hardly one can have words to speak so students now it's your turn if you have any question it's a wonderful opportunity 
You can ask. Good afternoon, sir. So, and it formed the basis of a story. The 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 devotion is there. The deity is there. But who is abandoned? Tanku neki onne mane kete prakar ra politics around for koruchanti. So it formed a story. Similarly, joda mu kahili mu pagan ko bishare. That is a real character. Real mu dekhili sabu katha. Same way, onne din so huye. Jodi mane the character comes to you. Otherwise, the event strikes to you, or something you come across which stays inside you, and you write about that. Yes, okay. Thank you, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Sir, I have a question. Sir, in every story, it is important to have a main character. So, sir, my question is that, sir, what should be the main feature or an important uh, important features of a character? That will make the story more impactful for the readers. I am narrating you a very funny incident. One day in the morning, I got a phone call. So I received the call. Someone from that side asked me, Sir, are you alive? He said, Mu to banchi chhi, mu to phone dhori chhi, mu banchi chhi ki nahi, mu to kaun pochhe uchhe. Aja se mu kotha sunle rohile. But after some time, someone else called me. Are you alive? What is happening here? Am I getting mad? Or these people are getting mad? Everyone is asking me, are you alive? Are you alive? So I am alive. So I am alive. What is the reason why they are asking me, are you alive? So I am alive. I am alive. I am alive. I am alive. A government servant with my name who was coming with a motorcycle near Jala. He met with an accident and died. And these people have thought that I have died. So they are calling me and asking me whether you are alive or you are dead. And that formed the basis of a story. Mu Morigala Pore, so Kahani Tara Nathila. So I didn't know that I have died, but everyone around me knows that I have already died. So because of that, that story came out. So you don't know where from the idea will come, how it will come, how it will touch you. Then you can write about those things. And your question was about? Uh, sir, uh, what impactful features a main protagonist of a ah, story can The protagonist, the protagonist, there I was the protagonist. Similarly, you may be the protagonist. You had a tiff with your best friend on a very flimsy ground. That can be a basis of a story. You can write about that. Ultimately, you realize that that was your mistake and you shake hand with your friend and everything is hunky-dory after that. That, that becomes a story. The protagonist short story is a set the protagonist is one around him or her some small characters go through but in novel there should be five six more characters which are very strong characters and you have to write about them you have to justify every character like you read mahabharata panchatantra mahabharata bitar farak kon panchatate sari jauchi kumbhira sanga hela mankada sangare mankada palela kumbhira pithre ta kola ghar ko leki jibi khaya pai batre kola to kalija khaibi Mankadra Buddhi Thila Bulli, he jumped up and came away. Kintu Mahabharata Padile, it's such a vast story. Kebola Panchu Pandava Nuanti, Ki Durjanana Dushasana Samane Nuanti, Ki Krishna Nuanti, Ki Kansa Nuanti. So many stories are interwoven in that novel. So that is the difference. Where many characters are there, where a single character is important. So Panchatantra Tales talks about a small story, but Mahabharata talks about a vast array of characters. Thank you, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Sir, a well-established author is respected and honored in every corner of the world. But if a child starts his writing in very early age and he is not supported by his parents, then what should he or she do to achieve that much uh, position? You see, that is a problem with our society. These days you see, don't, many parents don't want their children to become athletes. But you know how a cricketer gets paid, how the awards are given to athletes. 
I mean those who uh, participate in uh, Asian Games, Olympics, tennis, table tennis. So uh, we never heard about Neera Chopra. Now Neera Chopra is so popular, so parents have to look out for different directions and they have to see where the child is excelling, whether he is, has a flair for writing, whether he has a flair for sports, whether he has a flair for painting, whether he has a flair for singing, because every profession nowadays, it pays. It gives name and fame, but it also pays. It is not that a good singer will be neglected, a good writer will be neglected, never. So you have to motivate your parents. What have you uh, seen from three idiots? That's what he says that. I want to do the photography, wildlife photography, the character played by Madhavan. So he wanted to do that. So where he excelled, so that is what you want to do. You have to convince your parents that this is my field of excellence. Please allow me and give me these years. I will be excelling in this field. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, sir, for answering all the queries of our inquisitive minds. And with your patience, you have answered all the questions. Thank you very much. So as we are observing National Book Week, this entire week is dedicated to books and several book-related events, which sparked a renewed interest in the students. In this regard, few competitions were conducted for the students like bookmark designing, book cover designing, so, I would like to request our guest speaker, Sri Deva Prasad Das sir, and uh, esteemed principal ma'am to kindly give away the prizes and do the honor to the students. At the same time, I would like to request all the supervisors to kindly be on the stage. So the students are who got the best reader award, Amritasha Panda from Standard 11 Humanities. Amritasha Panda from Standard 11 Humanities. We have Amritasha here on the stage, best reader award. Then Arman Rath from Standard 10E. Tanmay Palai from 8B, Standard 8B. Sai Swaruprai from Standard 6D. Congratulations to all the students receiving the best reader award to have utilized the library services to have read the maximum number of books. So now we have the best reader award for the teacher and I'm very happy to announce that this best reader award goes to our dear teacher, Madam Meena Mishra. So ma'am, you are kindly requested to be on the stage. Madam is from Department of English. To have read the maximum number of books. maximum books in the most effective manner. Next we have the prizes for bookmark design competition. The first prize, Sai Swaru Prai from Standard 6D. Sai Swaru Prai from Standard 6D. Shrishti Panda from Standard 6A. And Roshni Priyadarshini Lenka for from standard 8F. So we have Swai Swaroop, Srishti, and Roshni. On the stage, 
they are receiving prizes for bookmark design competition a huge round of applause children then we have the prizes for book cover design competition and the first prize goes to shubhankar das from standard 9e second prize goes to anvesha anandita pati from standard 9c and the third prize goes to sonakshi das from standard 9c so all the prize winners are requested to come up on the stage all the prize winners you are requested to come up on the stage for a photograph to be stored in our memories forever I request Meena ma'am also to join them. Madam Meena Mishra. Chandrashekhar Pur to offer a token of gratitude to our guests. It's a symbol of our gratitude, a symbol of honor. Ma'am is offering Uttariya to Shri Deva Prasad Das Sir, a token of respect and honor. Thank you so much, sir, for being there and receiving our token of love, gratitude, and respect. Kindly be seated. So, children, the most healthiest and the most powerful emotion, human emotion, one has is gratitude. And to offer the vote of thanks I request Dr. Devati, sir, to kindly come upon the stage and offer gratitude. Jatiyo. पुस्तक सप्ताह पालन अवसर आयोजित यह मनोज्ञ कार्यक्रम को मन भरी उपभोग कर मोर विदग्ध श्रद्धेय छात्र छीगण आज कार्यक्रम तारका आकर्षण समानास्पद अग्रज प्रतिम श्रीजुक्त देवप्रसाद दास महोदय सम्मानास्पदा डीएबी पब्लिक स्कूल चंद्रशेखरपुर अध्यक्षा महोदया सम्माननीय आम विद्यालय मुख्य ग्रंथागारिक महाशय सम्माननीय तत्वधारक मंडल समस्त सहकर्मी वृंद एवं प्राण प्रतिम छात्र छीगण बास्तविक ये धन्यवाद अर्पण कर अवसर नुहे कारण एभली महार्ग सुजोग क्वचित लोक भाग्य जुटी था कवि लेखक मान द्वित ब्रह्मा द्वितीय ईश्वर सहित तुलना कराए 
संस्कृत कहुची अपार कव्य संसार कवि रेव प्रजापति प्रजापति बा ब्रह्मा से मान तो से लेखक कवि मान सानिध्य आसवा निश्चित भाव परम सौभाग्यर प्रसंग से ही सौभाग्य आमको प्रदान करमेश्वर पाखे आगे भक्ति पूर्ण प्रणाम अर्पण करे आम को ये महार्ग सुजोग पाने तुम निश्चय जान आम प्रतिष्ठाता अध्यक्ष महाशय जी अच्छा बर्तमान सम्मान डीएवि आंचलिक निर्देशक थिला ये मानस परिकल्पना पिला माने अनेक पत्र पत्रिका पुस्तक पढ़ुंता मन में गोटे स्वाभाविक कौतूहल जिज्ञासा सृष्टि हो लेखक मान सहित से प्रत्यक्ष भाव विनिमय करें सानिध्य आसवे मन रहा सन्देह अच्छी किसी प्रश्न उठुचे साजरे मोचन कर दूरीकरण करे यव कार्यक्रम संयोजना आठ वर्ष तेज होता अनेक कृतविद्य लेखक यही मंच रे आसी आम को सानिध्य धन्य कर सर्वप्रथम आरंभ होता गाड़ीपिक विजय नायक जी मोर शिक्षक देवाशीष पाणीग्राही महाशय दिवंगत लेखक डर गौरवी दास श्रीजुक्त सदानंद त्रिपाठी श्रीजुक्त राज्यवर्धन धल महापात्र श्रीजुक्त दास बेनौर तापर आज ये कार्यक्रम तेणु तो ये धारा निश्चित भाव में प्रलंबित ही चली आमर मानसिकता बौद्धिकता को प्रसारित करुच्ची तेणु तो मुर्वप्रथमे परमेश्वर पाखे भक्तिपूर्ण प्रणाम अर्पण कलापर आम बरण्य आंचलिक निर्देशक महोदय पाखे मुतज्ञता अर्पण करुच्ची आम को एमती एक सुजोग एवं आम को एमती एक अवकाश से देखते आज जी अच्छा अध्यक्षा महाशया से संयोजिका थे ये समस्त कार्यक्रम को सुचारू रूपे संयोजना करती सी मध्य गोटे सारस्वत वातावरण आंकर लेखक मान सहित मिसा एवं कार्यक्रम सामिल हबार गोटे स्वतस्फूर्त आग्रह रही जहाँ विभिन्न कार्यक्रम अवसर में प्रतिफलित गभर कृतज्ञता अर्पण करुच्चक सप्ताह अवसर में यही कार्यक्रम को स्वतंत्र भाव में संयोजित कर ताकू साकार सफल रूप देवे जी मुख्य अच्छा ग्रंथागारिक महाशय ताक आंतरिक धन्यवाद दूसरी यही कार्यक्रम सहित संश्लिष्ट समस्ते जो मैंने यहाँ साकार रूप देवार प्रत्यक्ष व परोक्ष भाव भूमिका निर्वाह कर निश्चित भाव में धन्यवाद पात्र तापर आसला सबुठ महत्वपूर्ण प्रसंग जे आज अच्छा तारका आकर्षण अग्रज प्रतिम जे आम विभाग में मो पूर्व से पाठ पढ़ुते तेणु अग्रज कह अत्युक्ति ना से गोटे सम्भ्रांत सारस्वत परंपर आस पाने तुम निश्चय जान लें खुशी हब आम जो विषय पाठ पढ़ के आसलु राजनीति विज्ञान तरह पिताम हूँ तार प्राण प्रतिष्ठाता प्रफेसर डक्टर श्रीरामचंद्र दास तो सेमती पर आसी निश्चित भाव अत्यंत से गोटे समृद्ध एवं भवदीय सारस्वत परंपर से निश्चित धारक एवं वाहक है तो सी के सौभाग्यवान जदि से प्रशासनिक अधिकारी हो न था तो निश्चित भाव में जो कृतविद्य अध्यापक होता जड़े भल प्रेरणादाता वक्ता होता है तो बहुमुखी प्रतिभा अधिकारी जो आम निमंत्रण कलु बिना दिवधार बिना संकोच बिना चिंतन सांगे सांगे से खुशी राजी हो गले पाला सानिध्य आसवा पिला गहन समय काटवा या ठूँ खुशी आनंद कथा कौन अच्छी तो व्यस्तबहता कार्यव्यस्तता सत्वे आमपाई स्वतंत्र भाव से समय किसी काढ़ी पार आम को आप्यायित करतधन्य कर सदा प्रसारित कृतज्ञ डीएवि चंद्रशेखरपुर पर तरफ मुझे आंतरिक कृतज्ञता और भक्ति सुमन अर्पण करम को साकार रूप दबारे जो मैंने सामग्रिक भाव संपुक्त संयोजिका ज्योति मैडम को समेत आउ जो मैंने अच्छा विभिन्न क्षेत्र में आमको सहायता कर समस्त नाम उल्लेख संभवपर न ये कार्यक्रम तरफ समस्त को आंतरिक धन्यवाद ज्ञापन करुचु समस्त निष्ठा आंतरिकता साहरी मंजूल रूप से सुविन्यस्त रूप से परिप्रकाश करार योजना आम कर पाने सर्वशेष तुम मान आंतरिकता सदिच्छा एवं धर्यपूर्ण श्रवण पर तुमको धन्यवाद दौचु समस्त तरफ मुदन करुच्ची आज 
लेखक महोदय को सी तर पुस्तक आम पिला पढ़ापी निश्चित आमको प्रदान कर धन्य करूँ आम पाठागार से रार सब आमको कहती व्यक्ति आसब चली कि पाठागार से सबुद रही थी तेणु आपण को नम्र नवेदन आपण स्वरचित पुस्तक आम पाठागार को दे आप आमको धन्य करेंगे प्रमिश कर बही सब पठेदेवी देवेन्द्र बाबू हाथ में आप लाइब्रेरी रही अनेक अनेक धन्यवाद तेणु समस्त को पुण् थे आनुष्ठानिक भाव में धन्यवाद अर्पण करी मो पर्व सांग कर जीवन और जय हो साहित्यर जय हो सभी मरी जात कवि डीए भी चंद्रशेखरपुर पर जाऊ साहित्य और जिगिशार विपुल पृथ्वी धन्यवाद जय जगन्नाथ वंदे मातरम वंदे उत्कल जरूरी